Well, welcome. Today we're going to be talking about Zeta 3.0, the latest uh, iteration of Zeta, our automation system play out here at RCS. Uh, it's all C-sharp, .NET, Windows 7, Windows 8, Microsoft SQL Server under the hood. It's all modern software. In fact, it's all Java-free modern software. We've removed all the Java from all RCS products for those security reasons you've heard in the news over and over again. So remember that Zeta is a multi-station, multi-user system. You can control multiple radio stations from a single location, or vice versa. You can control a single radio station from multiple locations. There's no concept of an on-air unit or a production unit. Any Zeta workstation can do anything. Of course, there's security if you don't want someone to be able to do something. But we have the ability to do anything from anywhere. It's a very, very configurable and malleable and very powerful automation system. Totally configurable by the user. So that when you log in, it looks one way. When someone else logs in, it could look a different way. So kind of working our way around here, the module that I have loaded at the top is the one that's called the on-air module. That's, of course, what's playing the radio station. That's where you choose your mode, your automation mode, your live assist, your satellite. All your typical transport controls are here. Start, stop, pause, change the chain. Uh, you know, this is where you, uh, your main focus of control. The log screen is where we do all of our voice tracking, our segue editing. Everything in Zeta is drag and drop, by the way. I can teach you how to use Zeta in about five minutes. Very simple to use. You'll notice as I go through the demo, uh, I'm not uh, loading any complex menus or having to do any keystrokes. You just use the mouse. You click and drag audio where you want it to go. I could take uh, this commercial here. I could drag that spot to Outlook and email that spot to a client. The um, log module is where we do our voice tracking. I click the voice track uh, icon up here at the top, and the voice tracker will load as a module. Now, I can pull that module out. So, typical three-click voice track, outro, voice track, intro. RCS invented voice tracking, by the way, in case you didn't know. The, uh, the next module over here is probably one of the more popular ones. Of course, the hotkeys. This is your instant audio. If I uh, pull this out, I can show you that Hotkeys can be any size you want. You create your own grid size. It can be as small as a 2x2 two two with only four buttons, or it could be as many buttons as you wish. The Z player is essentially a looper. I've loaded a song in here, and I can do a little something like this. Kind of a morning show thing. Very popular in Europe, Latin America. They'll take the intro of a song, and they'll loop it. So I've got the intro of this song just continuing. This will just loop like this, continue on and on and on. I can talk about the weather and talk with my morning show host and whatnot. But then when I'm ready to continue on, I turn off the loop. The song continues. Turn it off there. The song continues and I can do my rap. WRCSFM. Over here, we have what is called the notes module. The notes module is showing me artist and song notes that come from G Selector. Uh, G Selector, of course, is our music scheduling engine from RCS. With G Selector and Zeta, the one-two punch, you add a new song to G Selector, it's added for you in Zeta. And it's, it works both ways. If a jock drops a song, for example, in Zeta, G Selector knows about that immediately, in real time. So your song histories are always correct. So this is the 10,000 foot view of Zeta, the program, in a studio. But new with Zeta 3.0 is something we call Zeta to go. What Zeta to go is, is basically everything I've shown you. You have the on-air module, the log. You have hotkeys, you have a, even a voice tracker, and I can be in the field, I can control my radio station, I can fire hotkeys, I can even plug a mic in, do a voice track in the field uh, right from my tablet, it gets uploaded right back to the radio station. It's really revolutionary, and it's uh, extremely cool. It's Zeta to go, and that is part of Zeta 3.0. There you have it, Zeta. Thank you for joining us.